So the other day, I was looking through Instagram and this popped up into my feed. And you're like, what in the world is that? Well, it's a cradle for your cell phone that actually wraps right around your rear view mirror. And I thought, that is sweet. I definitely want one. Wouldn't that be cool for navigation when you're driving to hold your phone right up there? Keep your eyes on the road. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for You. My channel is dedicated to reviewing mostly as seen on TV items. I look at some consumer gadgets, other household items. Once in a while, I do a little bit of a DIY just because I like to. If that interests you, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and click the bell below. That way you're notified every time I release a video just like this one. Oh yeah, one more thing. Don't forget to check down the description for my social media, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. I would love it if you would follow me there too. Now, let's take a closer look at this phone mount that clips right on your rear view mirror. All right, so it's time to unbox our car rear view mirror mount cradle. I actually saw this on Instagram and I thought it looked kind of cool. Now I purchased this one off of Amazon and it was under 10 bucks. If it's something that interests you, I'll leave a link down in the description. Oh, look, looks like it could be a toy. Oh, 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 it's not. All right, so the idea is this part right here will clip on your mirror, okay? And the bottom half here is spring loaded, so these come down. And the top parts here, if you get it around your mirror, these actually cinch in and tighten up right to your mirror. That's cool, huh? All right, so now on to this part. So here's where my phone goes. Yet again, the spring's at the bottom. I do want to test to see if it works for larger phones. So on the back here, you might notice that I have a ball joint. It's where I can move this around. And once I get it to the place I want, I can tighten it. And then of course I have my tightening tension part here where I can get this to wherever I want it to be and then torque it down and tighten it. All right, so now what I want to do is I want to get my phone. I have a Note 20 and see if it actually fits inside this cradle area. All right, so I have my Note 20 here, and remember this is a spring-loaded thing, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna stick this here, push it down, Oop. I'm gonna have to use two hands, there we go. So it fits, it fits my Note 20. Now, you're supposed to be able to do it in portrait, or I'm sorry, landscape like it is, and also in portrait, but I'll be interested to see if the mirror is in the way of my phone. Um, smaller phones, it might be different, but you know what? First look, I like it. All right, so it's time to install this car rear view mirror phone mount. All right, so you can see that there's this U shape right here, and that's meant to go around the handle here or the bar for your rear view mirror. Um, so depending on your specific car, it might be a little different for the install. For me, I have my mirror is kind of thick, so I'm gonna go under here like this, and then I'm gonna have to pull, oops. Sorry, dropped it. Under here like this, and I'm gonna have to pull these bottom mounts forward. Just to get it to click into place. So then there's these top supports that you can cinch this up and slide these back. Therefore, it has like a nice tight grip against your mirror. So, pretty easy. I like how I can have my phone up and down. I can have it sideways. Now, for the bigger phones, this direction may not be as easy. Let me show you. You can see I have a Note 20 here, and my phone doesn't sit so well that way. But landscape mode, on the other hand, much better. All right, let's test this out driving. So now that we have this installed, I would love to get your opinion. What do you think of this mount? Is this something that's going to be beneficial? Not so much. Let me know down in the comment section below. I would love to hear from you. I really like the fact that I can keep my eyes up if I'm using navigation instead of looking down, but let me know what you think down below. So I'm really liking the position of the phone here on the um, mirror mount for my cell phone. I love that I can look here at the navigation as I'm driving along, but I can still keep my eyes on the road. And I know in front of me that, well, I have cars up there and such, but I'm okay looking over here. So I do notice that the phone there on the mirror mount, it does shake and wiggle a little. And the, so the stability part there is not that great. Um, but for navigation, it's perfectly fine. So I actually think that my mirror 
shakes a whole lot more than it did before. Actually, I don't think it shook at all before, but maybe the excess weight with the phone underneath it, um, it caused my mirror to actually shake. So in this video, we were looking at a phone mount that clips right on your rear view mirror. And some of the things that I noticed is, well, I don't know if it's the weight of my phone, but I definitely could tell that it was shaking. Now, did that mean I couldn't use my navigation? No, I just noticed that it was shaking and maybe it made my um, mirror shake as well. What I liked about it is I liked that my phone was up in my line of sight. So if I am using it for navigation, that's really what I would use it for. I don't really take my eyes off the road and that creates a whole lot of safety. And I like that. Some of those um, window mounts with the suction, those things sort of lose it and they fall down with this. It's pretty hard, pretty tough plastic and it just stays in place. Something else I didn't really show on video that I like. If you don't have like the speakerphone system in your car, well, I had my phone right up and my speaker's on this side and so is my microphone. So I can actually talk to people using my speakerphone function and it's sort of hands-free. And that I thought was pretty cool. Anyway, if you like this product, I will leave a link down in the description. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for you. As always, thanks for stopping by. I hope you have a great day. All right, so I've installed a little smaller phone on here. This is a Galaxy S20, so it's a lot smaller than the Note 20. So you can see it definitely works in the portrait mode as well as in the landscape mode. But the intent of this video, this part of the video, is I want to show you how you can adjust the tension here on your phone. So maybe it takes a little bit of the wiggle out. All right, so this is just through here in a ball and socket, right? And so if you just take this and tighten this right up, let's get it into place. And you just turn this, turn this like this, and it tightens it. And it makes it really difficult to move. And that's how you tighten it up. Now there's also another spot up here where you can loosen. Let's see, let's see if I can do that. And that way, I can adjust the angle just depending on my needs, right? Um, I just wanted to show you one, this does work with smaller phones, plus you can adjust the mount itself. All right, now we're gonna uninstall this. So it's real simple, just reverse the process. So I'm pulling these clips forward on the top. Remember how we cinched them around our, our mirror top and bottom. Because my mirror is a little thicker, I'm gonna push it up through the top part first, take it down, Voila, really easy to take off and move from vehicle to vehicle. I really do appreciate that you stayed around for my entire review of this cell phone mount that clips right on your mirror. You know what, not that long ago, I actually did a review of another cell phone mount for your car. This one's called the Clever Grip Pro. And that one had like a little magnet you put on the back of your phone and a clip that you put on your vent and you put it together and then, well, I don't wanna ruin it for you. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna link that review right up here and i would love it if you would click on it and check the review when you click on this link i'm going to join you right over there so go ahead click it it's safe i promise